it's special, special. They're at Asheville. And how long have you guys been making music together? All been on for seven years, but real solid for the past five. Right. Um, what about the songs? What are, what are the... Do you do the songwriting? Oh uh, yeah, I, I write all the songs, and uh, Kenny helps me bring them out, make them beautiful. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, tell us a little bit about uh, the CD. Um, we had you opened with a cover, and mm -hmm. is that one on the CD? Yeah, that's the only cover we got on the CD. Okay. Um, and did you write? Yeah, everything else is on the CD is mine. Okay. It's, it's, <laughs> I like to make sure, I mean, playing for a living, we gotta do some covers and folks let them know, let them know where we're coming from and all what musical waters we're drinking from, but I try to do mostly original material when I can. The CD's called The Blues and Beyond. Where'd you record it? We recorded it at uh, Echo Mountain Studios in Asheville, North Carolina. It's our second recording that we've done that. All right. Is it just the two of you? Is it just? Oh uh, no, we, we were actually we, we went in under the premise we were going to do it as an acoustic blues duo, and then uh, we ended up adding my buddy Tony Black, who's the current bass player from Marsh Tucker Band. He came in and jumped on a bunch of things. We had our buddy David Holt, like I mentioned, he came in and played on several songs. We got a long time Muddy Waters guitar player with Bob Mark Owen on one of the songs too. So. It's kind of hard to tote that band around with you everywhere. <laughs> We had to wait a year for Bob to play on one <laughs> song. A year. He's a big man. Well, um, y'all can, you got merch with you here today? Uh, we didn't bring any with us today, but we got business cards. You can check us out at rootsandarray.com. We've got all kinds of stuff for sale on it. We do have some these CDs oh, with us. He does. And I'd like to mention that my brother did the art one. Oh, my yes. All right, so uh, you can see them afterwards if you'd like to take some of this good music home with you. We always encourage our audience to shake hands with our performers and just say thank you. Uh, you know, they are headed right back over to Asheville tonight, so they just came over to do this for y'all and for us, so we want them to know we appreciate it. Tonight they'll be at 3 Walnut Wine Bar. In Asheville, and that's five women. Oh, that's five women. We'll be doing the full band. I'm scribbling here. Um, and then on the 12th, they'll be at the Jack of the Wood. I know yeah. I got that one. Uh, Rootsanddore.com. Um, it's spelled D O R E. Correct. Dore me. Dore him, like he said. Check it out with the money version of the book on this is Roots and Dore on the Blue Brain Special. <laughs> Thank you, I'll take that. Real quick, uh, same to this song. We recorded this one with David on the album, and he had brought out one of these cool washboard things. And he says, hey, Roots, play to me on this one. And it's a bluesy album, so we ended up turning it into a bluegrass song. As much as we love, we had to take it off the album. But we do have it available for download. Well, he sped it up twice as fast as I'm about to play it, so you can imagine how we do that. I don't think he knows we cut it, but it was a good time. A lot of people ask me, since I'm a blues man, how I'm doing all the time, so I like to just say I'm very simply I'm doing fine. Or a song about like a hero. Hey, hey, Get along, get along. Tip, 
something go wrong, so from home, all the time I sing, sing so long, but I don't know about me, I want, how you doing, Kim? Sound like Kenny doing fine. Then the last hit and ask me how I'm doing. Well, I'm doing fine. Life ain't so bad. I'm smiling till I'm dying. Living like the best I can. Walking down this crooked line. Well, I'm doing fine, 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 fine. Mm -hmm. I'm doing fine, doing fine. Say fine, 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 fine. Mm -hmm. I'm doing fine, doing fine. Say fine, fine. So, uh, life can be hard sometimes. You get to go through some hard times. And I say get to go through because these challenges and these hard times teach you how special and amazing these good times are. They give you a basis comparison because if not, how will we know what's really good? We haven't been through something bad. Before I get choked up on this one, we play this one. It's called Hard Times. Oh. 